I'm Lisa Gromlich. I am currently serving as president of AGU. I am Dean Emerita at the University of Washington where I teach large classes on sustainability. We are so glad that you have joined us at AGU 24. I hope this week brings you opportunities to have your curiosity expand, have you reconnect with colleagues, and especially to meet new people and encounter new ideas that will help form you as you grow as a scientist and science enthusiast that is part of our larger community. We are famous for the fact that we bring together tens of thousands of scientists and science enthusiasts to collaborate because collaboration is the engine of the best science. Now, what's great about the convening is, of course, you are collaborating, you're meeting your colleagues, but we always work to expand everyone's framework in which that science is taking place. So for me, the excitement of the convening has to do with some of the plenaries that we bring together to offer to the people that are attending. We have people this year like Governor Jay Inslee, a powerful spokesperson for why we will continue to work towards climate solutions. We have artists, we have environmental activists, we have an array of people that are gonna help us think about how, as we do our day-to-day -day science, how it fits into a much larger whole and gives our community a deeper sense of purpose and meaning. The AGU global scientific community continues to grow. I've asked myself, what is fueling that? And some of it is the fact that we are powered by curiosity-driven individuals. We have been for over 100 years. People that want to understand deeply the way in which Earth and space sciences simply operate and create the incredible universe that we live in. Elections around the world are changing the face of electoral politics, and many people are asking what comes next. I love to quote John Podesta, the senior advisor to the U.S. President on Climate Affairs, who at the recent COP, the UN Climate Conference, said, facts are facts, science is science, we are not turning back. So one of the things we know is that science continues through election cycles and political whims and waves, and that we at AGU will always be advocating for bringing science to the table to solve society's greatest challenges.